Okay, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, non-binary friends, non-binary foes, non-binary hands, non-binary toes, welcome back to a very English hyperlight drift of the show where you are the ocean's grey waves, destined to seek life beyond the shore just out of reach. Um, I'm not uh, where I start, where I finished off rather last time, because, uh, Dirk, play a few clips of that, uh, dubbed over with, uh, music, uh, with some sort of ragtime music, because I didn't actually record audio for it. I was doing that a lot uh, here because you, you can get a cool costume if you do that and then go over here, but uh, you, you have to do it 800 times in another, in, in my other playthrough, look, I got a, I just got a money bit for getting to 100, oh, that's bullshit, but yeah, anyways, I got to, uh, I got to like 729 and then I fucked up. Because basically, uh, before we get into the episode, what you have to do is you have to unplug your controller, here, I'll do it now. You have to unplug your controller, and I, between this episode and the last, I bought this new skill that lets you dash a bunch of times if you dash really quickly. Uh, and I remapped my dash to shift. Um, but basically, if you unplug your controller, you can, you can dash by just holding a mouse button there, right? And you have to do it four times a second, or 250 beats per minute, in order to have it... One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one... In, in order to have it do the thing. I don't know if I can do it without... I used a metronome to help me time my beats. Anyways, this is stupid. Um, but yeah, if you do that 800 times in a fucking row, you get a cool costume, I guess, and an achievement, and you get to feel proud about yourself, which I don't. Uh, but today, instead of going to the forest, which is over there, uh, we're going to the water place, which I explored on my own in my separate playthrough earlier today. And it's really beautiful, and it's not frustrating, and I don't want to have a fucking heart attack, so we're going here instead. Uh, there's a bit to explore on the way there, but fuck you! Yeah, yeah, that's right, that's right, go fuck yourselves. So, um, <clears throat> goodness, that was an odd cough. Yeah, I've been playing a little bit more of this on my own since last we met, um, which wasn't too incredibly long ago to be, whoops, wasted that. Wasn't too incredibly long, incredibly long ago, to be honest, he said in an increasingly weird accent. Oh, voice, I guess. It wasn't really an accent. I don't think anyone in the world actually speaks in a method that sounds like this all of the time. Unless they're from, uh, I mean, I genuinely don't fucking know. Just thought I'd blow that up. Seemed like a fun thing to do. Don't believe there's anything over here. But I've got an impulse to- yep, yep, to waste health anyways. Uh, fuck you, go fuck yourself, go eat a dick. Alright, so, I have- look at this, look at how pretty this is! Look at how gorgeous this area is! It only gets more gorgeous the farther you go in! There's some weird shit, but it's Hyper Light Drifter, there's always gonna be weird shit. But compared to that weird mountainy area with all the dank- d dank. Oh, this is not 420 at a dank. We're talking about dank as in, like, your basement's gonna get permanent tiling damage. But, uh, yeah, compared to the, the, the horrid, uh, evil underground laboratory aesthetic that was going on in, uh, in the mountainy area in our first area of this playthrough, this part, this place is beautiful! It's gorgeous! I wouldn't mind living here if it wasn't for the hundreds and thousands of corpses and evil... Monsters and I guess uh, I mean you'll see the rest later as we go forwards, but Christ this game just gets I I'm not gonna say I misjudged it because there are definitely still some faux pas that I'm very upset about that you'll be seeing as we move forwards um, Not faux pas. I say that in that. Ooh, hello there. Who are you? You strange uh, Dog man look at his little poopy nose. Oh, that doesn't look good. That man looks like he's got, oh, he's got something very wrong going with his weird cauliflower head. Alright, and the boss monster is over in the big-ass temple. That's great! That's a cool thing! I'm happy to hear that. 
Oh, Christ. Um, but yes, Hyperlight Drifter, I will not um, excuse... Well, not excuse as if I'm some grand arbiter to pass down judgment onto your waiting besmirched faces. I thought there was a thing. Oh, yeah, there is. Fuck you, plant. Uh, but yeah, I, I, I am no person to be passing judgment on a video game, of all things. I play lots of them, but I'm not a critique. Ooh, look, yeah, see, it's little ninja samurai fishmen. Fuck you. Oh, I don't have the skills that I had on my other playthrough. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, oh I, I shouldn't have bought that Zushi thing that I bought. Oh, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in a lot of trouble, guys. I am in a lot of trouble, guys. Oh, yay, money. Um, yeah, just so you know, as soon as I get three, I'm going back and buying some of the upgrades that I've bought in the other, in my other playthrough, in my other versions of this world, my alternate timelines, my, uh, city skylines. I've never played city skylines. Uh, I don't play many management sims, uh, period. But, you know, ooh, that looks cool. Oh, and look, the, the music's getting a little spike. Everything's fine. But yeah, I will not say that I, um, am it, uh, keep wasting those. Not that I'm ever going to come back here and get them in a different scenario, but still. Um, the, the faults, the problems that I had with this game before, I still have. I still think that some things are hugely unnecessary and irritating, and the whole... Is there, is there a point to that? Mm, there's no point to that. There's still a whole lot of walking around. Walking around and running up against walls and running up against things and it's it's still irritating But gods it it really has some beautiful areas. I just wish that the first area was less um, Thigh uh, I've said thigh rendingly before. Ooh, oh, oh, that's not good. I don't know why I sounded so excited when I saw that Oh, that's not that's not a good thing. I don't want my little guy my, li my little guy to die oh, I had a bloop I don't know why that... I, I still don't know why a lot of the things... Oh, that's why that. Okay, so, new lesson. If you hear that, it means that this thing is somewhere nearby on screen. I kind of suspected that going in, but still. Good lesson to learn, I suppose. But, uh, yes, I'm not rooting for this guy's death. And also to go even... Ooh, I guess I drained the power from this part of the plant. That's great! That won't come back to bite me in the ass later. Um... But yes, going going back, A, I don't want this guy to die, I just think it's probably kind of inevitable. Where are you guys, where are you guys carrying those? Oh, Alright then. I think it's kind of inevitable at this point. And B, um, the things that I don't like, I guess, about this game, I don't want to say it like that all super harshy judgy, but the, the things that rub my genitalia the wrong way about this game, um, still rub it in a very odd and patronizing manner. However, um, I'm also finding a lot of things outside of just the combat and the basic structure of the game, like, from minute to minute, alright? I know, okay, that you talked a lot about what you feel about this game, and you should just focus on the gameplay, but I'm walking here, so just fuck off. Um, but yeah, minute to minute, this game is really fun. The combat feels free, and it's difficult, certainly, and a lot of people may not want that in their video games, but you feel so... Fucking Zushi! I did buy that upgrade where I can Zush really quickly, didn't I? Yeah, I, I, I think I totally did. Mm, Alright then. Well, whatever. Um, but yeah, the, the movement feels free and fast, the combat feels Zushi and fun. Um, ooh, that's no good. Have I seen you before? Oh, I haven't actually been here before in my other playthrough. Alright, so... These dog people, these furries were praying uh, in the little water temple and a bunch of ninja lizards came out of the mud. Oh, they captured and beheaded their friends! Oh my god! And he ran away by, by breaking his chains. Christ, that is really sad. What the, what, why is it, why are all of these bad things happening in this world? Like, I... I know this is going to be one of those vague stories, but I hope we get more... Uh, I mean, I don't want to say closure, because we haven't really got any opener uh, yet, but I hope we get more to the story of these these strange... I guess, can't go up there. These strange people in this world than just these little snippets. Like, why are all of these weird revolu revolutions... No, I guess it is kind of a revolution of all these bad people. 
uh, coming into power. Why, why is this happening? Is it because of the weird apocalypse thing that I probably set off? Or, I don't know. But yes, just to finish up my thought before we finish up this first episode. Oh, oh, I'm coughing a lot more frequently now. That's not a good thing. That's not a good thing. Uh, yeah, but before I finish off this part of, uh, of uh, our first new recording session, um, the, the parts of the game that I'm not fond of, I'm not fond of. And obviously I'm no arbiter of taste. There are lots of people who will enjoy this in lots of ways, for lots of reasons. In all forms and senses. Some people will, as I do, enjoy the combat and the moment-to-moment -moment gameplay. Other people will really love the huge exploration-y bits where literally anything could be anywhere and the tells as to where everything is are very small and very uh, easy to miss. And some people will think that's that's brilliant and that means that you'll that, that it's like old classic NES games and shit and that's fine. But, um, for me, that part is what I'm not fond of, but the moment-to-moment -moment gameplay is what I'm fond of. So, uh, next time, more moment-to-moment -moment gameplay in, uh, big-ass fire temple under the water. Which is ironic, I suppose. Ha 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 ha. See you all next time! Love you all! Mwah. Bye! Bye! B busy, busy, bye. And I stop my timer. And I reset my timer. And I take a sip of water. And I pee in my pants. I don't do the last bit. I, I, I don't, I didn't, I didn't pee in my pants, Dirk. Don't patronize me.